Hey guys, Dan here for Epic Tuts. Um, I'm going to show you how to download or uh, install mods for Minecraft. Um, first one you want to get is WinRAR or 7-Zip, whatever. Just Google WinRAR and do the first link and then do the download uh, 64 or 32-bit. Um, both of them can use the 32-bit, but um, if you want better performance if you're on 64-bit, then use the 64-bit download. Um, and the mod I'm going to install is single player commands so just come over here uh, I'll put a uh, link in the download or well link in the uh, description and just click on this one or here because it's the fastest way to download it um, okay and then put that right over to the desktop and then go ahead and close this stuff and then you just want to, or I'll show you how to get to it. Just go into your uh, start bar down here and hit, type in run, and then go to this. Type percentage app data percentage. Hit OK. Top one should be Minecraft. Then go to bin. And then Minecraft.jar. I already have a copy of it. Um, well, yeah. What you want to do is just copy it and then paste it back in. I already have a copy there. Don't really need it. I've already installed this mod, but I'll just reinstall it. I guess it doesn't really do anything. Um, okay. So what you want to do is open with open with WinRAR and also open this okay and um, what you want to do is just select all of these files except for worldedit.jar and just drag them into this make sure you don't put them into any of the uh, any of the folders because that will screw it up and your minecraft will just black screen or error probably um, and I'm not going to do that just because it actually might mess up one of my mods. Because um, I have like five of them installed right now. So, and then what you want to do is drag the world edit.jar and only the world edit.jar into the bin folder. I already have it right here. Um, oh crap, did I just open that? No, okay. So, and then close that, close that, and then run Minecraft. It's pretty simple. Um, once you get the hang of it, it shake takes like uh, 30 seconds to do. Go and log in and then uh, all single player commands does is um, makes it so that you can do commands like you can if you've ever done if you've ever been on a server or have a server then uh, uh, then you know what I'm talking about you can do the commands like time day, fly, all that stuff. Um, this is another mod. Uh, it's called um, Buildcraft. So, um, so now you can just hit enter or T, I guess for you guys. I changed mine to enter because I like it better. And you can do time. Oops. Time day or time night. You can also do light, and that'll make it all light without making it daytime. So you can see it's still nighttime, but it's everything's light up or lit up. Um, you can do fly, set speed. Wow, can't type set. Oops. I haven't really used many, many of these, uh, many of this stuff for like a while because I haven't been playing Minecraft and been playing uh, Terraria, which is a pretty good game. Um, so yeah, and then if you just type, if you have all that stuff set and you don't want to like get it all back, then just type reset, and that'll change everything back except for the light, I guess. Um, and again, that is another 
mod right there. Oops. Um, this one is called Finite Water. It's all. It's another pretty good mod. This one is um, uh, Pistons mod. And yeah. So, oh, and also, this is a, is a mini map right here, right up there. And this is uh, too many items. I'm not sure I'm telling you all of my mods, but um, and yeah, so that's how you install single player commands. And if you want to know all the commands for it, just type help, and that'll tell you all the commands. So uh, yeah, see you guys.